We like clients who make big bets with big implications. And they in turn like us. Because you only have one chance to get it right. We've done six such launches in the past five years. But none better demonstrates the ability of a big idea to accelerate results better than WinMobile. When we were awarded the WinMobile business, they were a company of 10 people, about to grow to over 1,000 and spend up to $2 billion to bring new wireless choice to Canadians for the first time in over a decade. A well-entrenched, funded, and determined oligopoly of Bell, Rogers, and TELUS were not about to make it easy. We saw our opportunity in the frustration and sense of powerlessness that consumers had towards their carriers and believed that by creating a brand that was open, honest, collaborative, and maybe just a little fun, we could get Canadians to rally behind us. Using incubation sessions that use creative stimulus to get to deeper insights, we overcame the massive wall of cynicism that wind, indeed all new challengers, would face by connecting the brand truth that a company that listens to its customers is destined to make better things happen with this human truth. People simply don't like being told what to do. They like being involved. This led to a leverageable insight that conversations make things better. And ultimately, our campaign idea, the power of conversation. The first place we expressed it was on the wall of their office. But what really accelerated Wynn's launch was that everything we did thereafter, absolutely everything, would consistently build upon this single theme. We built our stores, for instance, with long wooden tables fashioned after kitchen tables, because the best conversations always ended up in the kitchen. We talked with customers from the highest levels of the C-suite and used their ideas to build and inspire funny online films, which in turn generated more discussion. One dollar, one dollar hot dog. One dollar. Thank you. Uh, Five fifty, please. I thought you said it was a buck. No, a uh, buck is just a naked wiener. You, you were saying that hot dog for a dollar. I mean, I, I That's the only way to get the customers. Uh, huh? That's only a con. It's a convenience one. fee, one dollar. Yeah. Preparation fee, seventy-five cents, yeah. and bun fee, one dollar. Convenience fee. Yeah. Bun fee, one dollar. Oh. Napkin, condiment, one fifty. Plus my time. Here is your change. You've used it. You've you've used the dog. Disposal fee, fifty cents. Five dollars and twenty-five cents for a hot dog. No. Okay, what I'll do, I'll just give you the hot dog and I'll keep the bun back. Uh, okay. And I need the napkin back as well, okay? You see, if I put the real price, I don't get any customers. From an HR point of view, we ran ads like this to hire people who are conversationalists. And where most companies say they put their customer first, we went one better and put them quite literally on a pedestal as they offered up their ideas for a better day in wireless. Ah, brave young architects of change. We tip our hats to you for speaking out against being scammed, hosed, and otherwise bamboozled. Your words shall live on in our hearts and in our phone plans. All I said was I hate phone contracts. And here I am. He fought for freedom. I just asked for prepaid customers to be treated better. Equality. Equality for all, she cried. Actually, I didn't cry it. I texted it. We've been gouged for too long. Give us real unlimited plans. Unlimited as infinity and then some. These ideas, our ideas, live on and win mobile. A testament to the truth that conversations can only make things better. Can I get down now? This culminated in a 25-foot statue to the real heroes of the day, the everyday Canadians upon whose ideas we were building a better wireless company. The Win campaign was recognized with four top CMA awards in categories like Integrated, Digital and PR for its ability to truly amplify social media. The term we coined is channel bushing to describe how we cross-pollinated channels and had them fuel and build upon one another. Input from the community became content for our advertising. People's ideas about building a better wireless company were filmed, uploaded to stimulate further conversations, which in turn were piped into the stores on digital walls to prove that yes, we were really listening. 
The Wynn campaign was of a scale not seen before in Canada. Every piece from traditional media to innovative projections and activations, from store designs to scripts for their IVR systems, from external packaging to important internal considerations like staff motivation, absolutely everything spoke to the power of conversation. How else could you launch something of such a scale against such entrenched competitors in just 317 days? The results proved the accelerating effects of our channel bustion process. Within five weeks, Wint had gone from a company no one had heard of before to the number one company people wanted to switch to. We grew at double the rate of the incumbents to build 100,000 subscribers in just six months. And by Q1 of 2011, Wynn was acquiring a staggering 30% share of new customers. Wynn was declared to be the fastest growing wireless carrier in Canada. Launching Wynn Mobile was an incredible ride. And while the challenges were formidable, the idea that we could accelerate growth by rallying every aspect of the launch around a compelling insight proved its worth.